really long. We're going to waste this one. Yep. Let's People just gonna wait because they get anywhere. Yep. Not anyone specific. Right. Just gonna wait. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna watch. Crazy. Um, that works. Yay. Brady. We still got about three minutes. Mm -hmm. All right. Brady joined. Mike Hamilton's here. Grandma's Grandma. here. Yep. All right, exactly. we're still a few minutes before showtime, folks. So, you don't have to leave. Yeah. Hello, me, Grandma. Me and Grandma said Christopher Robin together. Yep. That's a really good move. And then yep. after that, I had a Pooh and Piglet there. Yep. A Pooh and Piglet there is no come but gave me diarrhea the next morning. And Patty McBee joined us. And, uh, hey. Yeah. My mom's Rod right. is here. Yeah. We'll go get things started here in about a minute or two, folks. Hey, Rod. Um, we saw you. We're, we're a few we minutes you. early. We just saw Rod not too long ago. Yeah. Oh, so we got a little rain this evening. Really cooled things off. Gave me an excuse not to finish mowing. So, yeah. Daddy has to do it yeah. tomorrow. Though. Yeah, well, tomorrow or Sunday. Ah. <laughs> That's Less fun. than a minute, and I think we'll get into the show here. We appreciate y'all for putting up with our foolishness again. Yep. Oh, Mr. Lonnie's here. We're still waiting on 7.30 to roll around, and then we'll get into some spicy crunchiness. What are you doing that for? Time to see what time it is. <laughs> One minute, I don't know if that. No, less than a minute. Shouldn't be too much longer. Let me let up to buggy. It doesn't burn. Okay, we got a little bit. So, and Jessica showed up. Hey, Jessica. How are things in West Virginia? Hey. Anyway, so we called this the spicy, crunchy edition. Because we got. Well, we're about to tell you, Lonnie. We've got two spicy things and two crunchy things. Well, uh, actually, they're all crunchy. Well, they're all crunchy. And they all have a little bit of spice. Most of them. No, I think they all do. Chili gun case are doing that. What are those? Um, Peppers, right? But you, you guys will see it. So the first thing we're, we're going to start with, uh, Jeremy is here. Um, we've done some Takis before. Uh, that was Takis Fuego. Yep, yeah, we did Takis Fuego in a previous show. And we did guacamole. guacamole. Right, right. So today's Takis flavor spiciest. is called what? Takis Explosion. And they're not the spiciest Takis. Yes, they are. Okay, I, I don't think so. These were like uh, two for three dollars, so we got two bags. We've already gone through one. I oh. have milk for this situation. Yeah, yeah. So, hello, Jeremy. How are you? Last time All I right, you ready? I asked okay, you if, um, for my fellow peepers. Yeah. If you're not familiar with Takis, they're basically a rolled tortilla chip. Similar to a Dorito or something like that. These are, just so you know, the explosion flavor is a cheese and chili flavor. So, um, how do you take a bite? Yep. <laughs> That's all the milk you get, by the way. Mm. Yeah. 
and you have to finish that that talking. There's no way I'm finishing that. They do have a whoa. They do have a good chili and cheese flavor. More chili than cheese. <clears throat> there is a good deal of heat on the end. Um, There's way more. Um, more than you would expect, but it kind of befits the explosion name because it kind of hits you pretty hard right there at the end. It's right so, when it gets in your throat, it can hit you. Jeannie Jackson is here. Um, like that. All the way from <coughs> Oklahoma City. Um, preparing for her pending nuptials. She's getting married. Congratulations. So, but mm. these are tasty. They're good. I don't think TV it's... watching snack. You need I... to finish that one. No. Okay, I will. I will. I will stick with Taki's walking home. <laughs> <laughs> that one was the sweetest. So. And this. I hope everybody's had a good day. Um, mine started off rough. I uh, had some kind of stomach bug or food poisoning that was not real pretty. Um, someone was up playing my game at 2.33 in the morning. Nobody was up playing your game at 2.33 in the morning. That was an update. I told you that. Okay. <laughs> and the only one in the living room at 2.33 in the morning was you. And I was asleep. Okay. I so, <laughs> so there. Um but yeah, um, I don't know if it was food poisoning or what, but uh, it waylaid me for about half the day. Um, I spent a good portion of the day asleep on the couch, but woke up all better. Um, thank you, Lord. So um, next, we're gonna do. You want to show them what we're gonna do next? Um, ladies, sorry, thank you. Yep, ladies has become uh, famous for their case of America. Uh, where they do some limited edition special flavors. Last year they had the biscuits and gravy one. That one was gravy. Yeah. Um, yeah. That, you're in Montana, Lonnie? That's awesome. Um, uh, and you're headed to Wyoming. That's great. You guys must be traveling. Christy is here. Uh, Miss Brooke showed up. Brooke is getting married in September, so... Uh, uh, the uh, wedding folks are here. Uh, my cousin Harold from Maryland showed up. So thank you guys again. Oh, Chris. um, Christy, by the way, I can finally do my secret thing. Yay. 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 So we're about to try these chili con queso chips. Now, you don't think they're going to be spicy, right? I've had queso. Yeah, you've had queso, but I don't know if you've had these. So, so these are Lay's Tastes of America. Get like powder on it. Oh, that's good. Yeah. It tastes like chili. It tastes like queso from Lay. Not like um, blue paste. Blue paste. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Yeah. It, it's definitely got that this one. Mexican restaurant queso flavor to it. Um, a little bit of spice, but not real heat. I mean. The, the spice you get is just spice. It's not not heat, not going to burn you up or anything like that. I think this one, yeah. I think this is going to be more healthier than the actual queso stuff. Hey, you want to eat me, oh God. I bet you can't eat just one. I can. I can eat more. Mm. <laughs> that's your whole point. You can't stop at one. No, that's enough. Mm. So. Mm -hmm. Those are quite tasty, not really hot at all. Um, typical Lay's kind of crunchiness. Typical Lay's kind of crunchiness. So, why don't you tell them what starts next week? School. Yep. And my school starts on a Friday. Yep. By the first week, we only get one day. <laughs> yep. So, his first week of school is one day long. So. <laughs> Alicia Schneider is here. Hello, Alicia. Um, and my cousin Jack will be coming home with me. Yes, Yay! yes, yep, yep. Since we've moved, his school is about a block and a half from us, so that'll be really nice. Um, and after, before, when I heard about the school incident, me and my parents were a little concerned, but we found out about that. You, you what? You heard about what? There was a physical thing. Oh, yeah. 
Yeah. But now that we know or that the pit bull in the nether is place where Yeah, it's not near us. But we still want to be careful. Daddy said we had to get Yeah. Now this is the second Lay's taste of America. These are the bacon wrapped jalapeno popper flavor. And something so, I want to tell you guys, the next one is No, nope, no, nope, we're gonna don't ruin it. Yeah. Just like your grandma. So you keep your secret. Really, really hot. So these are wavy lays. So they're the, oh, I love the, the rippled chip. So if you kind choose like to the dip them in something. Kind yeah. of like the ruffles. Right? Yeah. They look right. like they were just ruffles put in the lace bag. This is sweet. But there actually is kind of a sweetness to it. Um, get a little bit of a bacon flavor. I get more bacon than I do jalapeno. Yeah, there there may be a little jalapeno there. I, I, Let me try another one. I don't know. I'm getting mostly bacon and sweet. Yeah, definitely more bacon. Mm -hmm. I was trying to. Hey, look who joined us. Mommy. Mommy. From all the way over on the couch. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, they're good, but I don't get any real I think they, jalapeno flavor. Well, I think they I don't know why they But they're good either way. So, they're not bad. It's not a... It actually is a really good bacon flavor. Um, so A lot of those types of products have a bake bacon kind of flavor to them and so if, like if you want something that tastes like bacon go ahead get this no nope. because if the other potato com potato chip companies let you down always go back to they they nope. never let you down <laughs> nope. so, so but that's because we live in Oklahoma, Oklahoma and we can't get gibble so um, all right so the last one I saw this in the so we we need to explain this, okay? Cheetos. What 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 hot things do you like? Cheetos extra flaming hot. Well, you've never had the extra flaming hot. You've had the flaming hot. My yeah. child, who poo poos anything that has just a little bit of heat, like he did with the explosion taki, yeah, loves yeah. Cheetos flaming hot. I well, had we came too. across. Go ahead. I had them at um, our little Wednesday night thing, and the kids would come, and they would have a search. They would be there, and I tried Cheetos Flame Hot, and they were pretty quick. So we came across these, hot. I and think we he was like, we have to try them for the peep show. I am not a fan of the Cheetos Flame and Hot, we get but we'll try them. So, oh, Miss Carol from Big Dan's is here. How are we you? How are you? Now, first of all, look at how red that is, y'all. It's it's kind of purple, actually. No, it's it's red. That's heat. It's so little, you go first. It's sort of purple. Mm. Oh my god! Oh! oh. <laughs> I now realize this was a mistake. Mm, 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 mm. Mm. You gotta finish that Cheeto. Those aren't that bad. That was so hot, I gotta use the bathroom. <laughs> I actually don't think these are hotter than the. I don't know what that's all about, but I don't think these are hotter than the the flaming hot ones. The flaming hot ones, I typically do not like. The problem with a product like this, you might want to wipe your hands off before you, yeah, um, is to me it's heat for the sake of heat, which I do not like, okay? Um, there, there's no good flavor there. Um, heat with good flavor is, is a good thing. Um <laughs> yeah, he'll try these, Harold, other hot stuff. Like he thinks jalapenos are disgusting. They are hot. They're, they're not hot, but they're disgusting. Get over here on camera. So 
Okay. So, yeah, you got to finish it. No. Yes. No. But they're not hot. They are. What? You and me have a different taste. I don't know why. I don't know how, but me and him have a different taste. I, I think the flaming Hot ones are hotter than those. No, the flaming Hot ones are definitely better. But of these four, trying to decide which is my favorite, which one did you like best? The bacon one. The bacon wrapped jalapeno popper one. I'm just gonna call it the bacon one. The bacon that 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 you didn't want to get. Oh, I thought it was gonna be jalapeno. Okay. That you didn't want to get, right? <laughs> so, okay. um, that was Daddy's pick. Actually, so. I'm gonna just pick both so. of the ladies. Oh yeah, yeah. No, you have to say you were right, Daddy. You were right, Daddy. Okay. I need <laughs> this mess. So. This mess. They're really good. If they have them, you might grab them because who knows how long they'll be around. These types that, of things are typically limited editions. They taste of America. I um, we'll ask again, is there anything you guys want us to do on a future peep show? Anything you guys want us to try, comment on, anything like that, let us know. You can comment here. Um, I have my own YouTube channel. Well, we have the YouTube channel set up. I haven't uploaded any videos. We will. Um, I need to get around to doing that. Me and Parker. Um, by the way, local peeps, I don't see too many of you on here. Uh, tomorrow, I'll be out at uh, Crystal Beach. Um, I'm going to be there, too, so bring you, your kids. You'll be there part of the day, but I'm going to be... Um, DJing and providing music for the Casa Grab, Root, and Growl. Um, if you come by uh, in the afternoon or evening, they'll be having the barbecue judging. They're going to have a barbecue contest. Daddy, um, Daddy needs to participate. Needs I will. Um, Ten bucks get you in, and you get to sample all the barbecue. Um, you get to judge, uh, and you get to decide, pick who the winner is. Um, I believe all the competitors will be local folks. Did you see so, all yes, the barbecue? you get to sample all the barbecue. Is, so, that's going to be the best so, day of yeah, my life. Yeah, come on by. Uh, it's 10 bucks, but it's basically all you can eat barbecue, and it's for a really good cause. If you don't know what CASA is, it's Court Appointed Special Advocates. Um, they help out kids that are in the foster care system. Uh, in the state of Oklahoma uh, by just going to court with them and advocating for them. So, um, uh, you know, come support a good cause, get some good barbecue. If you come by and you're there, say hi. Hey, Twig, how are you? Um, Twig just had foot surgery. I hope you're healing up well. Um, and, uh, um, but yeah, yeah, hope it didn't. McKinley says he hopes it didn't hurt. But come by, see us, um, and... Uh, I'm going to be a barbecue judge. Yeah. Everybody who comes and buys one of the tickets gets to be a judge. It, it's a great thing. So um, we pray you're blessed. We pray your family's blessed. Uh, and we, again, thank you for indulging us in our little frivolity. Um, God bless you. And as we always say, peace out. And now... Pledge allegiance of peace. Peace are the might, mellow, great way. The end. You just made that up. <laughs>